How to paper train your dog. Dogs have to learn bowel etiquette much quicker than humans. And these helpful steps will make sure your paper train pooch becomes man's best friend, not your carpet's worst nightmare. You will need patience, an untrained dog, a large supply of newspapers, puppy gates, an area of your home to enclose, preferably one with a tile or vinyl floor, your dog's bed, toys, and food and water bowls, dog treats, and more patience. Step one, muster your patience, heaps of it if you're training a puppy. Puppies will have a hard time fully controlling their bowels and bladders for at least six months. If the weather and circumstances permit, you can paper train a dog at the same time as you're housebreaking her. Step two, confine your puppy or dog to a small area, preferably one with an impervious floor such as tile or vinyl, by installing a puppy gate. Choose a part of your house where you spend lots of time so your pooch won't feel lonely. Step three, line the floor with plenty of newspaper. Newspapers run out fast when there's a puppy in the house. Your neighbors may have a stash they can give you. Step four, Put the puppy's bed, toys, and food and water bowls in the training area as well. Step five. Whenever your dog eliminates on the newspaper, give her a treat. The puppy will eventually equate doing her business on the paper with being rewarded. Step six. Replace the soiled bits with clean paper. Your puppy might want to play with the nasty paper, so check from time to time that the entire floor is still covered. Step seven. Dogs generally dislike going to the bathroom near where they eat or sleep so they'll eventually begin to do their business in one specific area. Once your dog has been doing this for a few days, gradually remove all newspapers except in this area. Step eight, after the dog is reliably using only one small patch of newspapers, you can begin letting her out of the training area into other parts of the house. Step nine, watch for signs that your dog needs to use the paper, squatting, circling, or sniffing the floor. You can then rush her to the papered spot. Remember that puppies need to eliminate frequently, about every 45 minutes. Step 10. Unless you live in the top floor of a high-rise and have a tiny dog, paper training is just the first step. Now you and your pet are ready to move on to housebreaking. Did you know? A small dog that's been paper trained can also be trained to use a litter box, which is helpful for homebound or elderly.